As you know, students are saturated with information every day from school to friends to social media. One thing that can be difficult to provide is perspective. World Vision and the Woodlands Christian Academy have teamed up to make that change. I spoke with Ronnie Brock and Julie Ambler about their roles in shaping future leaders. Struggle. We all experience it, but some of us experience it differently than others. For some, it's poverty or injustice. For others, it's loneliness or insecurity. But where there is struggle, there can also be joy. There can be growth and there can be hope. When we look at today's headlines, we see that there seems to be a lack of empathy, a lack of sympathy, a lack of patience. With that said, Ronnie, tell us what World Vision is. It's actually one of the largest Christian humanitarian organizations in the world. Uh, we are involved in a little over 100 countries and it, uh, everything from uh, economic development uh, to education, uh, a lot of things literally start with water, work with communities to bring water to that community. And then it just cascades backwards where there's education, economic opportunity. And the ultimate goal is that the gospel can be made known in the neighborhood. And Julie, uh, the Woodlands Christian Academy lets us know private school and you're able to really kind of impact the curriculum in a different way. Why do parents choose to send their children there? Well, I think the primary reason is because we're a Christ-centered school and we are equipping our students to become well-rounded leaders, spiritually, academically, physically, and socially. Right now, we're looking at education in a different way. We, we've all been forced to do it in a different way, right? Not only virtually, but also hands-on, doing different projects and things. So uh, when you have a partnership with World Vision, it kind of changes the way the typical classroom or curriculum uh, runs. So Ronnie, tell us how this partnership works. We partner with schools such as the Woodlands Christian Academy, uh, to bring them really three things. There are experiences that teach the students. There's a curriculum that they'll be working through throughout the year, but it actually begins with relationships with children living in poverty, connecting them with students there at the Woodlands Christian Academy. Julie, why is that important? I, I would imagine you, you probably teach geography, world history, you teach politics and all those types of things. Why is it important for these kids who are sitting in this classroom in the Woodlands to be able to connect with somebody on the other side of the world. We are trying to raise students who will go out as servant leaders and change the world for Christ. And so what we love about the World Vision Partnership is that our students have the opportunity to build a personal relationship with someone from a different background. And in addition to that, they have the curriculum that teaches them how to make a difference in the lives of someone else. Uh, World Vision has a phenomenal track record of helping communities and people to become self-sustaining. So our children will be learning about the importance of clean water and education and medical care, how to have better farming and ranching uh, techniques, how to set up businesses. And so they will learn the skills needed for communities to become independent through a personal relationship. And they'll also have a chance to solve problems uh, for these communities and to be active. So rather than sitting in a classroom, just listening to how to make a difference, they're actually making a difference themselves through their lives and through their relationships. Ronnie, I started school outside of this country. I, I've mm -hmm. traveled around the world. And when you see things that a lot of it, we take for granted in this country. So I know people may say to you, why not look you know, within the walls of America? Because we certainly have situations here that we need to, to work out as well. Uh, why look abroad? I can't help but think that, that one thing that's important is the students that you'll see at the Woodlands Christian Academy Academy and helping them understand the true needs that are out there. So whenever we say there's a need for clean water, we don't realize that the average uh, person living in poverty will, will walk six kilometers just to get water. Many times it's not clean water, but it's just to get to water and then to bring it back to where it is needed. In connecting with these students, we have chosen to do it a little bit different way. And one of the ways we launch these relationships with, this, with the Ignite Partnership is that many of these children living in poverty have never chosen anything in their life. They don't choose what they wear, they don't choose what they eat, they don't choose where they go and what they do. They've never chosen anything. Well, there's a group of ninth graders that are sitting there in North Houston that have humbled themselves to the point and you know, a lot of to the leadership of Julie and her staff to the point of allowing their pictures to be made so that 
these pictures will travel all the way to Zambia. And there, a group of students, again, living in poverty, will walk into a room and they will get to choose their sponsor. And for many of them, it's the first thing they've ever chosen in their life. Yeah. And to do that, it just brings these two worlds together in such an incredible and inspiring way. As you know, being a Christian organization, that saying, uh, give a man a fish, they'll eat for a day, you know, teach them how to fish, they'll, they'll eat for life. And planting that seed for those children in Zambia that they may be in poverty, but they have a partner in working their way out and, and making their country better. You're absolutely correct. You know, young people today have a passion for wanting to make a difference with their lives and with what they do. And so World Vision is a perfect place for them to really hands on make a difference and develop and learn the skills that they'll need throughout their entire lives to improve lives of others. So I think it's a great curriculum. I highly recommend it. I think the Chosen program is absolutely brilliant to hear our students over lunch saying, oh no, what if no one chooses me? It really humbles <laughs> them, which I think is wonderful. And uh, I actually saw a video recently of a young uh, boy uh, in an absolutely beautiful countryside with mountains behind him. And he was saying, I feel so sorry for the children in America because all they do is watch TV and play video games. Oh. These children have so much to offer our children from their perspective. And that I think just makes the whole program brilliant. World vision, a lot of power in those words, but a lot of power in the word ignite, which was uh, chosen purposely. It is meant again to, uh, to, to fan into flame the passion that are in many of these students. They just don't know what to do. They know they need to do something. But, but what to do uh, is, is important. And again, schools like, uh, like Julie's, uh, to bring that in front of the students is incredible. There is an opportunity for any school that's interested. There's a, if you go to worldvision.org front slash Texas, you'll, you, you can literally, it's just like being in classroom. You can just raise your hand and say, I wanna know more information. So if you go to worldvision.org front slash Texas, we would love for Texas to take the lead in a lot of this. Ronnie, Julie, thank you very much. And here's to a better world. Thanks to our next generation. Because we don't have to wait until tomorrow to make a difference today.